Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3 Fez. I am Katia Aiko and in the last episode we saved Fuka? Was that the last episode? No. That was the episode before, I think. Well, regardless, we did save Fuka at some point and picked up a few new side quests in the last episode. And in this episode we're gonna go to sleep and I think Fuka joins us? But uh, don't uh, quote me on that one. We'll find out. We're gonna go to bed first, and then we'll figure out what happens afterwards. That'll be how it is. I will sleep like a good teenager. I was gonna say child, but <laughs> I don't think Makoto is a child. I mean, do you? I don't think he is. I don't think he's a child. That's a little bit dumb. After school. I received a text message. It's from Akihiko. Fuka is being released from the hospital. Oh, good. We'll talk to her this evening. Come to the command room as soon as you get back. Okay. I will. Class has ended for today. Well, I guess I'll go to the command room. Oh, we'll crash into all the desks first. Yes, please. All right. Ah, uh, the dorm. So you want to know what's fun? The other day, my external hard drive. Uh, blew up and I lost all the data on it. So it's cool. It's my favorite thing. You're Fuka Yamagishi, right? Yes. <laughs> Relax. There's no need to be nervous. Why don't you have a seat? Everyone, you did an excellent job uncovering the truth. I also wanted to let you know, the three girls have all regained consciousness. What a relief! From what I understand, they each came to school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. They were attacked by shadows near the gate as the dark hour began. However, the facts became twisted because of rumors concerning a ghost story. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. It's all my fault. Are you kidding? You were the victim. But I made so many people worry. Hey, don't think like that. We could have lost that fight if you weren't there. You saved our lives. You should feel good about yourself. You have a special power that you can use to help others. A special power? We call it Persona. You could be a tremendous help to us. Will you lend us your strength? Are you asking me to join you? Mitsuru Senpai? You know, we're not trying to pressure you, so if you need some time to think about it, I'll do it. I'll help you. Are you sure? If you join, you'll have to live here. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. We really appreciate this. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Thank you. Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Um, it's okay, really. Now then, those special shadows showed up again. We still don't know where they're coming from, but Akihiko is right about one thing. Their appearances seem to coincide with the full moon. We'll take that into consideration from now on. So they're kind of like werewolves then, huh? It's a big advantage for us to know when to expect them. 
Now, on the day of the fight, we'll be ready to get in the ring. <sighs> Yay! We have discovered a pat pattern in the appearance of the special shadows. So what if this is what the boy was trying to tell you? It seems you should start paying attention to the moon's phases. And I like the game to not do that for me. Thank you, game! Alright. Let's talk to people. How you doing, man? Dude, she's the exact opposite of Yucatan. Smart. Nice. Hey, Makoto, what do you think of her? I think she needs a new voice actress. Is that all you think about? Dude, you need to lighten up. This is what being in high school is all about. Well, I mean, I'm a woman that's attracted to men. Uh, so I don't care. It seems like Fuku was forced to join us, even though in the end it was her choice. I don't feel good about this. Ah, you're fine. We achieved new powers and learned new information about shadows. Today was a great day for all of us. <laughs> oh, I asked Mitsuru Nakihiko to walk Fuku home. She shouldn't be walking home alone. Oh, so that's where they are. That's not cool. I wanted to talk to them. Oh well. Time to go to bed. Alright. So, let me think. Today is the 2nd of December. So this should go up probably the 4th of December. So, how was your guys' Thanksgiving? Those of you in the U.S. that celebrate Thanksgiving. I think Canada, I know Canada has a different Thanksgiving day. I know the rest of the world doesn't celebrate Thanksgiving. So for people in the U.S. that celebrate Thanksgiving, how was your Thanksgiving? I went over to Mom's um, and ate over there. It was fun. It was tasty. Because Dad went with his girlfriend to her sister's house the day before Thanksgiving for like a pre-Thanksgiving feast instead of a Thanksgiving feast. I don't know, it was weird. So since Dad went somewhere else, I was like, oh, well, I guess I'll go to Mom's. Hey, Makoto-kun! What do you think about Fuka? She's very helpful. You think so? I mean, yeah, her persona ability is great and all, but doesn't it kind of seem like she was forced to joining us? She'll be okay. She'll be fine. You worry too much. This is why I don't like you. That's actually not really why I don't like her, but... Hey, did you hear? Ikoda's in hot water. Really? What'd he do? I don't know, but it must be serious. Sexual harassment, maybe. Oh, I can totally see that! Hey, look, it's the ghost girl. Quiet, she can hear you. Um. Fuka, you in here? Moriyama-san? I heard you started living in the dorms. Yeah. So depressed. Well, let me know if you need someone to talk to. We could probably use a friend, huh? Moriyama san. Oh, come on. Just call me Natsuki. Thank you. Wasn't that sweet? Class has ended for today. Alright. Well, what day is today? The 12th. Yeah. I'm gonna do social links, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Going to practice. Coughing, yes. <laughs> yeah. Quick practice. Actually, wait. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Should be fine.
track team's giving it everything they've got. Cool. My sight's killing me. Don't overdo it, man. I run around in Tartarus at night, man. I build up quite the fucking stamina. Let me see you beat me. Check team, so Slink's reach level 2. Yay! I mean, I knew that. Shut up. What's wrong? Dude, don't twist your knee. What kind of fucking athlete are you? Time to go back to the dorm. Man, I'm really. I think I need a new chair. Hey, Juco, talk to her. What's up? Uh, wanna walk home together? Oh, uh, well, maybe next time. I was shot down. Sup, dude? They're getting Fuku's room ready on the third floor. No guy is allowed. It's cool though. I'm just glad she's coming. So we're here tomorrow, you know. No guy's allowed, huh? I'm gonna go into her room. You'd see what her and your car on the third floor getting Fuku's room ready for her. They're cleaning it up, you know, dusting and mopping. Is it the cause if there are any cockroaches that need to be killed? Uh, these floors have carpet, don't they? How are you gonna mop the carpet? I heard Fuka's teacher, Mr. Ikoda, is in a lot of trouble. It must have been because of Mitsuda Senpai. Scary, huh? You are the power of Kirijo. Yeah, well, Mitsuda is badass, so, you know. She she does what she wants. She kicks ass, takes names, then drop kicks you. Hello. I apologize might be able to go to Tartarus for two days in a row. Preparing for Yamagishi's move has taken longer than I anticipated. So that's that. As you can see, the girls' rooms are on this floor. Males are not permitted. I'm here, you can't stop me. That room is filthy if no one's living in there. Please don't let there be any cockroaches. Which one is it? I forget. Which one is Yukari's room? <laughs> okay, that's Mitsuda's room. Is this Yukari's room then? Oh, shit, I didn't want to talk to you. Ah, uh, this one. Okay, so then it's that one or that one that they're cleaning, I suppose. I'm gonna go inside this one. Oh, I guess it is wood floor. I mean, I guess you can mop wood floor, although typically you don't really want to mop wood floor. Can I examine this door? Aha! Uh -huh. I mean, I think if you mop the wood floor, you fuck it up, because you don't want to, uh... I am in... Uh... And then Yukari's room. Or fuck it. Fuka's room. Yukari's in a different room. <laughs> Did I walk through Yukari to go to bed? To get out of that door? Is that is that what happened just now? Well. Um I know a thing happens, I think, when I go into my room. So I'm gonna end the episode here, and in the next episode, um, I'll go to sleep, and then we'll do a quest, I think, the next episode, and it'll be fun. So thanks everybody for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!